What's happening, YouTube? Cowboy here, and we are ready to continue in Far Cry 4. Decided to take some money, bought the PKM, just because after my last run-in with a Asian Rhino, I figured I'm going to need some heavier firepower if I'm going to kill one. And we also bought some uh, pretty sexy camo. The Recur Bow. It's a, the Stalker one. It's like 20,000, but... Either way, opening the door we go, and away with the cutscene. No! You're a drunk! I would not want to walk in there right now. What are they arguing about? Pagan Min soldiers are about to attack one of our camps. Amida thinks our priority should be the information the fighters have gathered. Sabal thinks saving our people is more important. How long have they been at it? Long enough. The argument never changes and their positions never move. Look, I don't want to bother you, but you're Ajay Gale. Right? <laughs> Thank you for helping us. Everyone here appreciates it. I owe Golden Path for rescuing me, but honestly, I'm just... I'm just here to scatter my mother's ashes. Perhaps. But now you see what Pagan has done to this country. You are the son of Mohan Gale. Like it or not, your duty is Kirat. And your choices will carry weight. We need someone to break the stalemate between Amita and Sabal. Keep that in mind when you're in there. Time to make a choice. This is about lives. We don't act people who die. This is about war. We need that intel. We're talking about soldiers we can use. Remember what you said about DARPA? And if I had a choice between Bourbon and the intelligence, I choose the intel. <sighs> All right. Now we learn about the balance of power. <clears throat> so, basically, talk to both leaders, pick a choice. This uh, creates different objectives in the upcoming missions. Kind of changes how the game will go. Gives it a nice little bit of replay value as well. And I just realized I have skill point. I don't know, man. Riding an elephant would be pretty badass. But so would a four-slot healing syringe. You know what? Fuck it. Let's get let's get our throwing knife. I've been talking about it for a while. That'll let us take out two guys at once with the takedown. All right, and we are gonna go to Anita. Now, just to clarify here, I don't have favorite between her or him, but in my mind, God knows how many people have already died to get this intel. So saving the people is is pointless. You know, if we don't get the intel. What's the point? Amita. I can get you that intel. Okay. We've been hearing of a major attack for a while, and then Bonapur was hit, but... It doesn't feel right. I think something big is coming, and the intel could confirm that. But we haven't heard from the camp since the attack, so... Watch yourself. To want us to receive intel from a nearby Golden Path camp. Accepting this will decline Sabal's mission. Yes, continue. Sorry, Sabal, but intel is intel, bro. Like she said, we're in a war. Gotta play it smart. So in general, as I go through, I'm gonna always pick, in my opinion, what I consider the most logical choice. Right here, yeah, you know, like I said, who knows how many people have already died to get that intel, so. It, it doesn't make sense to save lives if it means losing on the intel that's gonna help us prevent an even larger attack. And besides, who needs soldiers? I'm like a fucking one-man army. Right. 
actually... Fuck this. You guys are probably wondering what I'm doing. I'm taking the mini helicopter, baby! Woo! Be safe. So an important thing to note with this thing, initially I thought you had gas. You don't have gas, but you do have an altitude limit. So, as you can see, if we go up high enough, you'll start hearing it. Where's it at? Right there. You hear that? You hit B, you get back down to a safe altitude, and you're set. So you obviously got to be careful when you're using this thing, simply because of that altitude. Um, you obviously don't want to go too high and risk stalling out. Oh. Higher karma sounds really useful. Um. I can only imagine how awesome this thing will be to help get the radio towers as well, just like I, I doubt I can fly straight up to the radio tower and be like, yep, got it, unlocked, but... What's this? Is this a secret area here? I don't know, I'll come back to it later. I'm in the middle of the mission. I saw a bunch of shinies, was like, ooh, stuff! Can't get distracted, gotta stay focused. Let's go, here we go. Bunch of climbing points here, too. Not quite as quick as like the glider or the wingsuit, but definitely allows you to cover a much larger distance. Hunters are silent lethal units that communicate with whistles. They can see you through vegetation. Being tagged for a few seconds, then it disappears, and they can charm predators. Basically, these guys ain't nothing to fuck with. So, I want to see something real quick. Overdose, survival, focus, faster. Okay, so that does, it's enemies and animals. So we're going to pop that right now. Last thing we want is to have the hunters come up on us. We want to see them before they see us. Except I'm a little bit worried because I don't see any. Let's search the bodies. Okay, got intel. There's a lot of dead people here, you know, like. If we had just passed up on this intel, that would have been terrible. Fuck. Ah! Ah! They have flaming arrows! Oh my god! I didn't see any. I looked. I looked earlier. Oh, there he is. guys are fucking rough. Hell yeah! That's what I'm talking about. So I'm guessing they're gonna show up as I progressively begin to get more intel. Went 
through quite a few arrows though already. There we go. That will definitely help. Oh look there, that's one of those uh, crazy fish. The ones that I was talking about. I think it's nuts as these guys are super effective and all they have are uh, basic bitch bows. Look at that thing. The thing looks vicious. I've seen river monsters. I know how these fish work. I try to bite, bite your nuts straight off. I'm not even kidding, man. This demon fish thing or something, something fierce. There's only been one hunter so far. Is there a body? Oh, yeah. There we go. Got it. Alright, so where do we go now? Can I just take off and get out of here? Amita, I got the intel. Okay, Ajay. Now go to the other camp and see what you can do. And just a little trim. Hunter. The fuck? Shit, there's a bunch here. Gonna burn down my helicopter. You dick. Did the helicopter blow up? I think it did. Yeah. What an asshole. Nothing to loot on you. There's way more hunters over here. Fuck, let's hit another syringe. Looks like we're about to get into some actual combat. And oh, yes, we are. One. Oh 
Shit. Oh, I'm dead. I'm so fucked right now. Healing on the run. Oh. That guy's fighting the wolf. Shit. Oh my god. This is no bueno. I did not see any of these guys before. My blade has a In the dick. Oh shit. Looks like I'm gonna have my work cut out for me against these guys. And oh my god, the Hawks of Doom! Those were good soldiers that died. Tell me they didn't die in vain. Tell me you found the intel. Fuck you, bird! Or something. Okay, Ajay. This could be important. I'll check it out. And thank you. Thank you for following my lead. Man, I'll tell you what, man, these guys. Like, I got a chance to mess around with them back when I was, uh, I was in San Francisco in the demo build, but. Well, for starters, I don't remember having to fight that many of them. And on top of that, I don't remember them doing that much damage. I mean, I guess the demo build they had us playing, they, we were all beefed up on a bunch of upgrades and things like that, so. I, mean, I guess it's understandable, but man, those guys were. Fuck wallet almost full? I never thought that would actually happen. Oh shit. Oh, I'm getting off the road. I don't have the kind of firepower to take on a real cargo truck. I need like an RPG for that. Alright. Just a little bit of looting, a little bit of cleaning up and we are out of here. Either way, though, guys, that is another one knocked out. Obviously, up next, we have a B on the map as well. There's a B. Sabal, way the hell up there. I'm starting to see the fortresses. And where was there a B? I saw a B. Real cargo. B is that way. Ah, Badra. The little, like, 12 year old girl who our great protagonist is probably trying to get jiggy with. It's creepy as that is. Alright, well, either way, we're gonna spend some of this money. Um, actually, based on where I'm at right now, I feel like this is a good point to kind of stop for a bit. So, more than likely, um, We'll just hold up and wait till the live stream event on Wednesday, because we're going to go through and knock out an absolute shit ton of content. You know, get upgrades, get outposts, all that stuff. So, more than likely, you guys will see the next episode sometime after that stream on Wednesday. So, make sure to stay tuned, and we will catch you guys next time with more Far Cry 4.